it's time for a Christmas party. Feels like Shank Hall. Merry Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, good to you. Happy Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, too. Whichever you celebrate, I hope it will be great. Let's everybody pray that Santa won't be late. Merry Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, good to you. Happy Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, too. And to all of you Buddhists and Hindus and Muslims and Scientologists, too. Merry Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, good to you. Merry Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, good to you. Merry Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, good to you. Welcome to the Pandemic Christmas Show. 2020, what a year. This is going to be a very unusual show. Wistful, yet celebratory. Because I'll admit I am not in that great of a mood. Lately, the state I'm in could be greatly improved. But I don't want to bring you down, so I'm not going to sing the blues. I'm not going to gaze at my neighbor. Shoes. Nothing quite like the nightmare that we're going through. Every day, every night, I feel like giving in. But I don't want to be a downer, and you don't want to hear me whine. I'll save that for another place <laughs> and another time. Because now. It's not the time for sad songs. No, it's not the time for sad songs. No, it's not the time for sad songs. Hard times we've had songs. That's right, there is no time for sad songs tonight. But I'm gonna do a few. will not drag you down the emotional drain. I won't share my, my life, my misfortune and pain. I don't want to be depressing, and you don't want to see me weep. I'll save that for later on when I'm trying to sleep. Because now is not the time for sad songs. Oh, it's not the time for sad songs. No, it's not the time for sad songs. Hard times we've had songs. No, it's not the time for sad songs. No, it's not the time for sad songs. No, it's not the time for sad songs. Feeling bad songs. Not a tortured artist. I'm just fine. I just want to smile a while and drink some Christmas wine. So now is not the time for sad songs. No, it's not the time for sad songs. No, it's not the time for sad songs. Hard times we've had songs. No, it's not the time for sad songs. No, it's not the time for sad songs. Songs. Now it's not the time for sad songs. Feeling bad songs. Now it's not the time for sad, sad songs. Oh. I flip the coin heads i'll become real religious burn all my books except my bible love my enemies and my rivals put my faith in jesus's hands and cancel all my dinner plans tales i'll become an atheistic heathen guess which one 
I flipped a coin. Heads, I'll become a conservative businessman. Go to school, get my MBA, be a CEO or a CPA. Buy a big house with a fence around it. Make so much money that I can't count it. Tails, I'll become a hopeless dreamer. Guess which one? I flipped a coin. Heads, I'll become a master of the classics. Play Mozart and Rachmaninoff. Dance just like Barishnikov. Hold a skull in my hand, say, alas, poor Yorick. Design buildings with columns, Corinthian and Doric. Tales, I'll sing goofy songs in my garage. Guess which one? This will tell you which one. Probably the goofiest song I ever wrote. I flipped a coin for Laura Elvers. Thank you, Laura Elvers. But Jesse Snyder, Carl, Carl wants you to hear the goofiest song I ever wrote, Jesse. He wants me to sing for you. He almost conquered half of Europe till he got beat at Waterloo. And on his deathbed, this is what he told his friends to do. Put my body in a tomb like all the great ones are. Chop off my little saber and put it in a jar. Oh, yes, this impish little emperor who inspired a symphony. He said, I hope you'll name a brandy or a pastry after me or both. And of course you'll come to Corsica when from this life I part. Feel free to drink to me, then tear my bone apart. That's right, Jesse. It was Napoleon's penis, Napoleon's penis. There wasn't much between us, just Napoleon's penis. The original French tickler, say bray, say tray petite. Genitalia on display for all the world to see. The original French tickler, say bray, say tray petite. Genitalia on display for all the world to see. So now whenever I'm in Paris And I'm stuck in some museum Those boring Mona Lisas, man, I just don't want to see them There's only one attraction There's only one I've known It's the first thing that I'll tell my friends The minute I get home And as I ponder my existence Let it roll through my mind I wonder just what part of me that I might leave behind. I guess I'll keep on dreaming and wishing upon a star. And if in case it's not my face, I've got this little jar. Little? Just like Napoleon's penis, Napoleon's penis, His Highness, His Sereneness, Napoleon's penis. I know it's gonna thrill you, no matter who you are. Napoleon's penis, it's in that little jar. I know it's gonna thrill you, no matter who you are. Napoleon's penis, it's in that little jar. Napoleon's penis, it's in that little But here, in the Christmas holiday season, don't you think we should put Christmas back in Christmas? Don't you think there should be contemplative religious music played tonight? Well, Nathan Gable, Nathan Gable wants some religious music, and I'm glad to play it for you, Nathan, because God loves capitalists more than communists. God loves fundamentalists more than Methodists. God loves Americans more than Canadians. God loves nuclear power. And God doesn't love the Pope. God accepts him more than Coke. He won't drive a... Oops, should I... I should have said, and God loves the stars and stripes. God loves handy wipes. Think they're so convenient. God knows where the yellow went. God has a VCR. That's how old this song is, huh? John Wayne is the biggest star up in the ivory tower.
right, Nathan? Second verse. God doesn't love the Pope. God likes Pepsi more than Coke. He won't drive a Subaru or a BMW. A fly just flew past the camera. You know it's warm in this garage. God packs a magnum for protection, not for fun. God says, make my day. And God votes Republican the only way to, I don't know anymore. God loves making dough, don't like paying taxes, though. God loves Disneyland, loves a man to be a man. God loves the USA. God loves democracy more than aristocracy. God hates Iraqians, Russian Jews, Libyans, Democrats, gays, uh, feminists, scientists, doctors, experts, you name it. God is good, God is great, God don't like the welfare state, he hates Sweden. God drives a Chevrolet. God made petroleum to make my Winnebago run. God made plants and trees, we can waste them as we please. God loves the strong and tall, he loves Pat McCurdy most of all. God loves the USA. God loves the USA. God loves the USA. He told me personally, so I know what God likes. Ah. Matt and Jolene Peterson. Nicole Code or Cody. This is the song I like to usually play second at my Christmas show because it's all about the star of the show. Am I right or am I right? How can a fly be alive when it's 38 degrees out there? That's just, it just hatched. You guys at home would not believe the array of heaters we have to be able to play in this garage. It is toasty. What's the temp? 60 degrees. And we have the stars of the show. We have Jesus and Santa right behind me, ladies. And Jesus can answer our questions. Blink once for yes, twice for no, Jesus. Are you a big fan of Matt and Jolene Peterson and Nicole Cody? Yeah. In that case, he's dressed in white. He's always clean. He's my main man from the Nazarene. That's Jesus. Jesus Christ. He's making a list. And he's checking it twice. Don't let Jesus break your dishes. Peeping on those loaves and fishes. That's Jesus. Jesus Christ. Woo! He's going to find out who's naughty and nice. Jesus at a party has a real good time. Changes water into Boone's Farm wine. Jesus. What? The guy who played Crockett on Miami Vice. And that's how old this song is. Jesus drinks until he's unconscious. Look out, Jesus. Here comes Poncho. Jesus. What? Jesus Christ. Woo! His favorite song is Foreigners Cold as Ice. His, did you just pick something to surprise me? His favorite song is... I can't really sing anything. Well, I can. His favorite song is. No. His favorite song is. You know, it wouldn't be Christmas if I didn't take all the Santa songs and all the Jesus songs and switch them around. Am I right on that or am I right, Jesus? That's right. I'd like to take all the traditional Jesus songs and all the traditional Santa songs and then switch them around. I'd like to sing. I saw mommy kissing Jesus Christ underneath the mistletoe last night. Up on the rooftop, tap, tap, tap. Here comes Jolly Jesus Christ. Oh, come on, that's really funny. Yeah. Away in a main 
manger, no crib for a bed. Our little Lord Santa lays down his sweet head. Come on, that's funny. Oh. One toke over the line, sweet Santa, one toke over the line. Sitting downtown in a railway station, one toke over the line. Jesus, baby, hurry down the chimney tonight. Come on, come on. You better watch out, you better not cry, you better not pout, I'm telling you why. I let you guys sing that one at home. And they sang it in the garage. Oh, hold it, I got some more, I got some more. Hold it. You do this up here. Your own personal Santa. Santa Claus, superstar. Do you think you're what they say you are? Oh, come on guys, that's funny. You know, Tony Kalish, Tony Kalish wanted me to do my Christmas greeting card songs. Not my Christmas album, but my Christmas greeting card song. He wanted to do, he wanted to hear this. I'll do it right now. I had a job writing 20 second songs for the inside of greeting cards that they sold at Target for about two years. And the best seller, best one was this one. It had a guy on the front of the card with a real nice suit, drinking a cocktail, wearing a Santa hat. And you opened it up and it was me singing, all I want for Christmas is a dry martini, a cocktail weenie, a chicken, a bikini. All I want for Christmas is a dry martini. Joy to my world. Ah, oh, Tony! No begat ham, ham begat shem. Who begat my friend from Bethlehem? I've been Jesus. Sing it! Jesus Christ. Woo! When he wants to pick up chicks, he puts on a little old spice. By minute. Joseph said to Mary, say what? That conception was immaculate. Jesus. Jesus Christ. Woo! He's making a list and he's checking it twice. Christmas. Uh, thank you for tuning in to show number 29, second to the last show of 2020, 2020. What a great year 2020 was. I'm in my garage instead of being at Shank Hall. I truly missed being at my Christmas shows, handing out the shit people give me all year. But let's meet who's responsible for tonight's show. Let's, let's meet the staff of tonight's show uh, on sound as usual. Number 29 for this man, Mr. Pipe Jim Shuffleburger. And he made dinner for everyone tonight. Yeah, pot pie with the chopped up tater tots on top. It was delicious. On, on camera, on camera and visuals, or as I like to say it, visuals, Mr. Kevin Hansen. Or should I say, handsome Kevin Hansen. He's back tonight doing the cue cards. He's back holding up the names. And maybe he'll do a little singing for us later. Mr. Julian McCurdy, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that handsome progeny of my loins, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that guy. Uh, the mistress of alcohol is not available right now. But speaking of alcohol, why don't we pour a drink? This is the Addington bottle, by the way. I'm still working on the bottle the Addingtons gave me. <laughs> we'll just swirl it around, ladies and gentlemen. And every time I say Christmas, and that's going to be a lot of times tonight, we're going to have a drink. Here's the Christmas. I have a Spider-Man glass, ladies and gentlemen. You know, Michelle Kreider, Michelle Kreider, I know you're out there watching this because you're getting your hip replaced. Yeah, yeah. During the holidays, in a pandemic, I've got whiskey all over my chin. I got whiskey all over my chin! <laughs> I'm 
gonna shout to make your uh, hip replacement a little easier. A song for you. I got a reason to live, to wake up every day. Put on these fashionable clothes and go on my merry way. I got a reason to do the crazy things that I do. I got a reason to live, and Michelle, it's you, you, you. Michelle, it's you, you, you. I got a reason to live. Face the world with a smile. I wish that everyone could stand in my shoes for a while. I like to sing in the rain, dance down the avenue. I got a reason to live. Oh, Michelle, you know, it's you, you, you. Yeah, it's you, you, you. Now, am I just a hopeless dreamer? Yeah, that's my story. Is that an electric eel? No, that's a more. I got a reason to do the crazy things that I do. I got a reason to live. Oh, Michelle, it is you, you, you. Yeah, it's you, you, you. I got a reason to live. I don't just sit here and mope. Nope. If at the end of the day, hey, you're at the end of your rope, then you should end up with me. I think it's time that you do. I got a reason to live. One more time, Michelle. It's you, you, you. Yeah, it's you, you, you. I got a reason to live, and it's Pipe Jim. I got a reason to live, oh, Kevin. I got a reason to live, Brian Murphy. I got a reason to live, Julian. We're watching Ted Lasso later. I got a, I got a, I got a reason to live, and it's you. It's you. So appropriate. My actual sister is in this garage. Zach Patton. Zach Patton, I don't know if you have a sister. But if you do, you best believe it. I was ready to kill when you told me that you'd put my sister on the pill. You smug little snot in your baggy pants. In your Yankee Hill apartment full of hanging plants. Don't touch my sister. Don't touch my sister. She's the only good thing my family's got left. Only good thing. Hey! My mom is Muriel, my dad is Bob. We haven't talked much since I lost my job. They give their love to their other child. Try to keep her from running wild. Don't touch my sister. Don't you touch my sister. She's the only good thing that Bob and Muriel got left. Only good thing. Aye. Oh, look out now. Look out, Kevin. It's not about you, Josh. But they say your father is a wealthy man and you're an uptight young Republican. But there's a mean side to you that doesn't always show. A mean side to you and you know I know. So don't touch my sister. Don't touch my sister. She's the only good thing this family's got left. Only good thing. Don't touch my sister. Don't you touch my sister. She's the only good thing in this whole damn world. Only good thing. Keep your 
filthy hands off that little girl. Keep your dirty hands off that little girl. Keep your stinking hands off that little girl. Keep your stinking hands off that little girl. Thank you, Pat. Thank you, Zach Patton. I promise you I would write a new song every week. This week is a song inspired by all the British detective shows I've been watching. Yeah, this one's sort of wistful, but very romantic. If you're with someone you love right now, take their hands and get ready to learn a new chorus to sing to each other. Two people up on the screen Obviously more than friends Intimate close-up scenes Filmed with a soft focus lens And now comes the gentle rain The plot's getting very involved a kiss on the evening train that fades with a slow dissolve. I am yours, you are mine, and that's all there is. Love so real, love so fine, and that's all there is. All the stars are alive. And that's all there is. I am yours, you are mine, and that's all there is. The city's so cold and gray, and now she's ignoring his calls. He stands in a dark alleyway, graffiti all over the walls. She's in a noisy bar, and then in her ex-boyfriend's loft. Cut between him and his car, and someone's clothes being taken off. But I am yours, you are mine, and that's all there is. Love so true, love so fine, and that's all there is. The stars are aligned, and that's all there is. I am yours, you are mine, and that's all there is. Two people up on the screen. I am yours, you are mine, and that's all there is. Love so rare. Love so fine, and that's all there is. All the stars are alive, and that's all there is. I am yours, you are mine, and that's all there is. I am yours, you are mine, and that's all. Kim Peterson, you are probably overwhelmed by the romance of that last song. And your request really doesn't fit in this spot, but it's for you, Kim. Don't honk your horn at me, get upset or angry. Don't stick your finger out, no need to shout. Why don't you pass me by? I see no reason why. Why we can't share this road and still be friends. Sometimes it's a blessing, sometimes it's a curse. I always drive in reverse. Let me say, they are singing their asses off in this garage. Why? Because the vocal cords are so warm right now. Jesus, how you feeling? Are you warming up? 
I'm walking backwards too, so I can only see what's going on behind and not in front of me. I know where I have been, I know what I have done, try walking backwards too like everyone. Sometimes it's a blessing, sometimes it's a curse, I always drive in reverse. Pedestrians, sometimes I lose control. I always drive in reverse. No matter where I walk, no matter where I drive, the place I want to be, I never do arrive. Go on and pass me by, I see no reason why, why we can't share this road and still be friends. Sometimes it's a blessing, sometimes it's a cursing. You may get the faster, you may get the first, but I always drive in reverse. I always drive in reverse. I always drive, you always drive, we always drive in reverse. Kim Peterson, come on! Merry Christmas, Kim Peterson! Ah! Is the mistress of alcohol still yelling at her younger son? Oh, mistress of alcohol, let you didn't get introduced. Get up here and bring something. Ah, yeah, it's hot in here. It's beautiful. It's barely on that. Ladies and gentlemen, it's 65 degrees. This is the best Christmas I've ever had in my garage. Sure. Next week, we'll, oh, yeah, we have one more show this year. Isn't it sad? It's kind of the end of a year. Yeah. Yeah, it's such a great year. We're going to have a Boxing Day show next year. Next week, we uh, normally the, on that night, we would play at the Admirals, and you would come to the Admirals game in downtown Milwaukee. So we're going to try to get, uh, we're going to try to make this a hockey game in the garage. We're going to freeze the floor. We're going to ice the floor. We're going to Zamboni it. We're going to have hockey sticks, and we're going to try to get that big, giant mascot over here. Roscoe, Roscoe. Yeah. So what a family event on Boxing Day. Yes, we're going we're gonna to knock a few of our teeth out and then uh, have pucks, uh, random pucks flying throughout the room. Yeah, and mini, uh, we're going to have a mini blimp fly around and give Palermo's pizza certificates. So here's the Christmas. Here's the mistress of alcohol. Oh, yeah, we're going to have a T-shirt gun. And we're going to shoot people in the nuts with it. Thank you. I got to carry on with the show. We'll see you later. Let's see who, let's see who, some of the people we have to say hello to right now. First of all, I would like to tell you one thing. That Kevin Hansen, my camera guy, Deluxe, Ted told me this week that we have had 2.7 million minutes of viewing time on the first 28 Facebook shows. That is more time than it took Pfizer to make a vaccine, ladies and gentlemen. And we have one more show this year. That's uh, next Saturday. And then a couple weeks off, and we'll start up again in the new year, 2021. I want to say hello to Mr. Peter Jest, who gave me a nice phone call this week to say that he missed seeing me at the Christmas party at Shank Hall. I'd also like to say thank you to a Ms. Lisa Locke. I wish you could see this close up, because it's embroidered and it's beautiful. And it says, Shit Show 2020. She makes these ornaments, and she, oh, Lisa, thank you so much. I'm going to cherish this. Go to Lisa Locke's Etsy account, and you can buy some stuff with obscenities on it, too. So, <laughs> Kevin, who's this show brought to you by? The MacArthur Foundation, the Bradley Foundation, and viewers like you. Let's say hello to anybody who contributed money last week. Marissa Rogers, thank you. The Eliases, the Eliases, there's... Mainly, sometimes they're in the alley. Carolyn Rosewall, uh, another familiar name. Matthew Doherty, Mark Degner, and David Pike. David Pike. Whenever I meet someone with the last name Pike, I think of the Star Trek pilot where Captain Pike, well, we'll go into it later. Michelle Beckerest, Catherine Church has got a job. She starts in January. <laughs> Laura Tucker. Laura, are you still blasting? It might be Tuesday. 
Yeah. I, if you got my CD, oh, by the way, don't forget to get one of these this week. Uh, Laura loves It Might Be Tuesday, track three. <laughs> Top of the Mountain Company. Top of the Mountain. How about Andrew Bakuber? We said hello to you last week. Holly Jude and Scott Camerad. Spin it around, 510. I, I, mean, I mean, Julia. <laughs> Let's see for Ariel Brath and Shana Shalou and Phil Weiss. Rice Weber, Phil Rice Weber. These are names that we say people contribute every week, and I want to say thank you because it has kept us afloat. Josh Zilmer and John Finley, thank you. Billy and Amanda Berger, you liked my request for Amanda last week. Nancy Willauer, Becky, Becky, Nurse Becky. Nurse Becky's getting the COVID vaccine next week. Frontline health worker. How about Dave Hallbrooks? Thank you, Dave. Mark Reiner. I wrote a song for Mark. Oh, Mark helped me write a song called uh, Living in a Red State and Being Blue. Yeah. Bruce and Sylvia Haroldson, thank you. Lindsay Bees, I, I love knowing your name. Sharon Dynek, one of my closest friends in the world, Sharon Dynek. You didn't need to. You really didn't need to. All the recommendations for shows are enough. <laughs> Tina Winkleman, thank you. Stevens Patrick, you know we've said his name before because I love that name. Hello, Stevens Patrick. And last but not least, Jan and Doug from Sa uh, San Diego are 28 for 28. And Ruth Ann Rosser from Menominee Falls. Dang, Ruth Ann. And now, the country music portion of my show. I wrote a country song that has Christmas in it. And that's why I'm playing. Oh, Christmas. I made it the part of the country music portion of the show tonight. I wrote this song for Johnny Cash to sing, and then he died. Right, it goes, I'm so happy because I'm getting some. Life's so snappy when you're getting some. Told my pappy I was getting some. I can't keep mum when I'm getting some. Excited cause I'm getting some. So delighted to be getting some. You're all invited to start getting some. Cause everyone should be getting some. Must be a miracle happening to me. I'm back on my feet again, just where I should be. should be you're wondering where's the Christmas part of this song well it's right here I'm okay because I'm getting some I said hey 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 I'm getting some on Christmas Day I will be getting some Pa pum I'm getting some everyone should be getting some sing one Johnny Everyone should be getting some. Everyone should be getting some. Yeah! Cheryl Andrews, 28 for 28. Proprietor of Cheryl Andrews Designs. Eric Brock from San Francisco, California. 28 for 28. patient man, you know I am, but you're pushing me to the limit. Imagine a picture of me and you, only you're not in it. You've been on my back for a trillion years, I can't take another minute. Imagine a picture of me and you, only you're not in it. Imagine a picture of me in a Cadillac, speeding out of town. 
imagine a picture of our happy home burn to the ground. It's an endless fight. I'm wrong, you're right. Ain't no way I can win it. Imagine a picture of me and you. What? We're having a country Christmas. No, on Hallmark Channel. It's a country Christmas. Oh, today I bought a Christmas tree. I saw the dreamiest man at the Christmas tree lot. Gentle snow started falling down. I thought I could fall in love with that rugged guy, even though I come from the big city and I don't belong here in this small town at the Christmas tree lot. Christmas! <laughs> don't miss Christmas waltz. Right now, I'd like to write a song for the two people who requested this song. She's in the Fox Valley, and she's looking fine. And she's well known for her acrylic design. And they're singing, roll out the barrel. Happy Christmas to Ms. Andrews. Specifically, Cheryl. Two people requested this song. Here's another, another one. He lives in San Francisco, and he can see right up the block a marijuana dispensary. Who's the man? Who makes San Francisco rock? And we have a round of applause for Mr. Eric Brown. Imagine a picture of me in a Cadillac speeding out of town. Imagine a picture of our happy home burning to the ground. It's an endless fight. Wrong, you're right. Ain't no way I can win it. Imagine a picture of me and you. Garage! Imagine a picture of me and you. Only you're not in it. Okay, I don't know how to pronounce this next name. First name D, last name Latoy. D Latoy. D Latoy. Does that mean something? No. D Latoy. Because we can't go to the movies very much right now. I, that, I think that's why you want me to sing. I don't believe in God. I don't believe in the flag. I don't believe in anything. I just believe in movie stars. They come from heaven in Italian cars. And I believe that they are almost divine. They have sex all the time, and it's good. It's always good, because it's with movie stars. The thoughts are so much more profound than ours. And I believe that they know things I'll never know, go places I'll never go. They're so smart, and their teeth are perfect. And when I go to church, down at the multiplex, I pay 11 bucks, I eat some raisinettes, I stare up at the screen, I wait with bated breath, I wait with bated breath, I wait, I wait, I wait, I wait for movie stars. Flag. I don't believe in anything. I just believe in movie stars on Mount Olympus or Mount Palomar. And I believe they've got impeccable taste. They make this world a better place to live in. And I don't want to live in a world without movie stars. Look in the sky, it's a bird. It's a movie star. Look in the sky, it's a bird, it's a plane. No, it's a movie star. Look in the sky, it's a bird, it's a plane. No, it's a movie star. Hey! Oh, 
like uh, sing a song for Mr. Bruce Shower right now. Bruce Shower had a great idea for me this week. He pointed out that 1991, I made a CD called Pat McCurdy and the Sound of Music. Unbelievably, it's 30 years later. I should do the whole CD in order sometime next year. It's got great songs, Bruce, but not the one you requested. The one you requested is from a different album. Round the corner from the Hotel Belmont. In a coffee shop full of broken faces. Keep my eyes and my ears wide open. The romantic places. What will I do when I find it? What will I do when I find it? What will I do when I find it? Will I? Caught up in the crosstown traffic, drifting on an empty ocean. Everybody walks on pins and needles. Don't want to cause no big commotion. What will I do when I find it? What will I do when I find it? What will I do when I find it? Will I laugh? Will I cry? Will I know? Will I die in pursuit? Left my home just last December Used to have the strongest feeling Most of which I can't remember What will I do when I find her? What will I do when I find her? What will I do when I find her? Will I? What will I do when I find you? What will I do when I find you? What will I do when I find you? Will I laugh? Will I cry? Will I know? Will I die in pursuit? Will I laugh? Will I cry? Will I know the reason why I'm in pursuit? Will I rise? Will I fall? Will it make no sense at all in pursuit? I'm just chasing a dream. Ooh, I'm just chasing a dream. Ooh, I'm just chasing a dream. Ooh, I'm just chasing a dream. I don't know what people have been doing in, in lockdown and pandemic. Many of us have not followed basic rules to halt a pandemic. To those people I say, come on, get smart. But I know that this next song is one of the most requested songs I've had in the last 29 weeks. That means maybe this activity is going on a lot behind closed doors. You know, Ron Deli, I don't want to say anything to you, Ron Deli, except for the fact that you are 28 for 28. And you requested this song, so I don't know what you're going to do right now. I'm just going to say, I've been swimming in a pool of goldfish, pretending they're piranha, sleeping with a girl named Kimmy, pretending her name is Donna. Like to know what I'm doing in my shack out in the woods. I can't tell you, but it's something feels so good. I'm choking the gopher, I'm slamming the ham, I'm pounding 
the rocket, flogging the dolphin. Oh, yes, I am. I'm choking the gopher. I'm chalking the cue. I'm spanking the monkey. And I'm thinking about you. I was looking right in the camera and imagining all the people I'm thinking about as I'm eek. But listen, is anybody watching this show tonight? 500 people, I'm thinking about 500 of you. If there's two people watching per computer, I'm thinking about 1,000 people naked right now. Especially you, Ron Delhi. <laughs> I've been working in a coal mine Pretending I'm digging up diamonds Hanging around bars and nightclubs Pretending I'm social climbing Would you like to know what I'm doing? We hours of the night I can't tell you But it's something feels so right I'm choking the gopher I'm slamming the hell, taming the lion, slaying the dragon. Oh, yes, I am. I'm choking the gopher. I'm chalking the cue. I'm spanking the monkey. And I'm thinking about you. Where Kevin goes, Kimmy follows. Where Kimmy goes, Kevin follows. We are so fortunate to have Ms. Whiskey Bell herself up here to sing about me. Are you ready, Kimmy? I'm juicing the mango. I'm flipping the switch. I'm orbiting Venus, and I don't need a penis to be one sex a bitch. Gilding the lily, I'm taming the shrew, I'm saucing the taco, and I'm not thinking about you. Every time I get to that point, my heart is broken, just because your handsome fiance is sitting right in front of me. Can't you just tell the truth in front of Kevin for the umpteenth time? Buffing the muffin, I'm petting the cat, I'm driving Miss Daisy, and I'm thinking about Pat. Yeah! Take that, Kevin Hansen! Sorry, baby. Thank you, Kimmy. Let's hear Kimmy right now. Everybody in Facebook world, all 1,000 of you. Best part of the night. Whoa! Oh, wait. Hold it, hold it, hold it. I didn't think of something new tonight. Okay, here we go. I'm grinding my chocolate. My cup is all pimmy. I'm Jack climbing his own beanstalk, and I'm thinking about Kimmy. I'm smacking the cracker. I'm attacking Peru. I'm choking the gopher, and I'm thinking about you. I'm choking the gopher. for Kimmy Unger. Nobody I'd rather spend my Christmas time with than Kimmy. Ah, delicious. Shit storm, shit storm, shit. Shit show, shit show. Oh. I wouldn't, there's no one I'd rather spend my Christmas with than my dog, Bo. Hey, 
Hey, Bobo, can you hear me? Bo! Bobo! Bobo, come here! A man and his dog. Bobo, look at this. Look at this. Come up here and say hello to everybody. Come here. Oh, he won't. He's so well trained. Come here, Paul. Come here, Paul. Here you go, Bobo. My dog! Thank you, good dog. Yeah, looks to see if I have another one. It's a guitar pick, Bo. It's a guitar pick. Yeah. Oh, he can, he can stay. Remember the first show? We were in the living room, and he laid down right next to my feet. I don't know what the hell was going on. Well, uh, Brian Simpson, one of my favorite people in the entire world. Brian and Erasa Simpson are in lacrosse right now, and I hope they're watching this. You can stay there. Right now, I'd like to sing Brian's request that he gave me this morning. I don't normally do Friday morning requests, but Brian, because you are one of my favorite people, and this is one of my favorite love songs, I'm singing it. And I want you to sing this to Eraser right now. It goes like this. I love your hair. I love your skin. If you had one, I'd love your twin. You can't believe, you can't believe how much I love you. Now, what we're going to do right now is have some talent. How about, how about, you? no, should we do you or you? Yeah, you get up here. Mr. I'm drinking Bud Light. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Floppy Haired. He could be the next Harry Styles but I don't want him to get tattoos until he's 21. I don't want him to get tattoos even then. Tell me you don't have a tattoo. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, singing to no one in particular, Mr. Julian McCurdy. Here we go. I love the ground you walk upon, the telephone you talk upon. You can't believe I love you. Yeah. You can't believe it, but it's true. I love your parents, because they had you. I love your grandparents for having them. I could go on and on and on again. I have a new verse. I'm wondering, I bet I can't, I bet I cannot talk her into doing this. Not Bethany. Well, maybe Bethany for the last verse, but Julia, maybe Julia. You are entering our bubble. We do all the COVID protocols, so this microphone is completely tested negative. You know what to say. Ladies and gentlemen, my sister Julia. And I hope, ooh, you smell pretty tonight. I hope you're gonna sing this towards Josh because I'll sing to Josh. I love your elbows and your knees. Love your idi. Oh, sing Sing it. I don't know the words. You can't believe. You can't believe how much I love you. Yeah. Close enough, honey, close enough. My sister, let's hear for her right now. You know who we should, you know who we should have sing this last? I mean, Kimmy sang on that mic. Maybe we should have Kevin sing on that mic right now. Handsome Kevin Hansen. Return the favor, Kevin. And I'll sing to Kimmy too. Here we go. I love each letter of your name, each vowel and con. And ain't the same. You can't believe, you can't believe how much I love you. You can't believe, you can't believe how much I love you, Brian Simpson. You can't believe, you can't believe. 
how much I love you. This is the warmest this garage has been since October. 68 degrees! Yeah, we got the, well, the heater's right near the thermometer. 69! Hey, Jesus, you know what, how many, do, Jesus, are you thrilled by how toast, oh, I already asked him that. I, well, Jesus, is 2021 going to be better than 2020? Yeah! We got the word of the Lord. I'm going to switch guitars right now because this one is vaguely out of tune. I'm going to give this one to Kevin Hansen for Christmas. <laughs> Jesus is Captain Pike. We already mentioned Captain Pike in this show tonight. These are people... This is a people who can transfer their matter between planets, but they put Captain Pike in a little machine with a blinking light and, yeah, two blinking lights. Close enough for rock and roll. It's time for some challenges, ladies and gentlemen. I believe I sang this next song twice. Twice, ladies and gentlemen, and the last time was at least 19 years ago. I don't believe I ever did it again after playing it twice because it seemed a little misogynistic to me. I'm not sure why. But of course, Mr. Oak Creek, Mr. Philly Dog, Joe Hip, somehow has access to a lot of rare songs. And Joe Hip requested that I sing this song for his wife, Melissa. I'm gonna pretend I'm Joe while I'm singing to Melissa. You can have your fashion models. They don't do much for me. You can have those little rich girls living in a sorority. You can have those Christian women, all pious and repressed. I like those hippie chicks, because they make love the best. You can have those naked pop stars. They're OK. You can have the goths and punks that might come your way. You can have those business women, housewives, debutantes, the rest. But I prefer those hippie chicks because they make love the best. I guess the point of this song is I need someone to get high with and do it all night long. You can have your business women, debutantes, housewives, and the rest. But I still like those hippie chicks because they make love the best. I still like those hippie chicks because they make love the best. Oh. Mauricio Lopez from Texas always has a request that sort of is very timely. This is a, this is a, a challenge. I don't think I've played this since 2002. And I'm not sure. Mauricio, you know, you live in Texas. We're the soldiers of stupidity. Our number's growing strong. We are marching across the USA, dumb as the day is long. We're the soldiers of stupidity. We're proud of our low IQs. And if you think you're dumb enough, you can be a soldier too. If ignorance is bliss, I'm as happy as can be. Sitting like slugs in front of the TV. They never read the papers, cause the news is always bad. But they never miss out when there's fun to be had. They're the soldiers of stupidity. The numbers growing strong. They are marching across the USA. Dumb as the day is long. They're the soldiers of stupidity. Proud of their low IQ. And if you think you're dumb enough, you can be a soldier too. If you think you're dumb enough, you can be a soldier. 
If you think you're dumb enough, you can be a soldier too. And then there's April. April sitting out there in Las Vegas. Sitting out there in Las Vegas at a slot machine six feet from another person at a slot machine. Requesting songs that I didn't even remember that I wrote. Like this one. Forgetting it already. You've been faithful. You were a nun while I was away. Dang, I can't remember how it goes. I practiced this April. better check on the website. Look up. Yeah, right. Who's got the fastest internet in here? We got it? We're paging through, April, right now. I want to get this good for you. Cause I know that it's not true And I'm still so suspicious of you Yeah, right That's my t-shirt Although it's not even my size Yeah, right That's my toothbrush The one that I don't recognize You say no one's been eating my porridge And no one has slept in my bed Yeah, right yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. It's all wrong, what I'm saying. Because I know that it's not true. But I'm still so suspicious of you. Yeah, right. You've been faithful. You were a nun while I was away. Yeah, right. You just sat around here and thought about me night and day. If you miss me as much as you tell me, then who is that guy in the shower? Yeah, right. 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 Took me a while. And those are tonight's challenges. This is not a challenge. It's a song for Gordo on his birthday. Gordo! I have always been responsible. I've always had a sense of obligation to God and the fly to mom and apple pie. What's come over me? Don't know where in lies this insanity, but I have to live at least once before I die. So tonight, I want to ruin my life. I want to throw it all away in a spectacular way. Tonight. Something dumb, and I don't care. I, I feel.
feel like I've been suffocating, hesitating, waiting for a moment when I could even try to flap my weary arms and fly. I, I know I miss the family, miss the house, the dog, and the Jeep Cherokee, but I have to live at least once before I die. Something dumb, and I don't care. No, I won't care what happens when you close that door. I don't care what happens to me anymore. anymore. La 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 Damn, I'm inspired by Christmas. Which is on Hallmark Channel tomorrow. Inspired by Christmas. It's a big meeting of Candace Cameron Beret and what's her name? Lacey Chavert. And I, I know I miss the family, miss the house, the dog, and the Jeep Cherokee, but I have to live at least once before I die. Are you with me? At home, are you with me? Everybody sing to Spectacular way tonight. I want to ruin my life. 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 And if I'm going down, you're coming with me. Thank you, Garage. Hey, cue card man, are you up? We are saying hello and thank you for donating to my show and keeping me afloat to Jennifer Schmidt. I love you, Jennifer. Vicki McBride, every week, Vicki McBride. I think I had a request for you that I'm not doing this week. Paul and Lara Marker are 28 for 28. Lynn Riley from Madison, we played at her birthday. Tap Dancing Kelly from Madison asked me if I would sing a few nasty Christmas songs, and I will for you, Cap Tap Dancing Kelly. Oh, come, all ye faithful. Joy to the world, the Lord has come. I'm so sorry. Andrew, Andrew Maltor, thank you so much. Cindy Dixon, I'd like to say hello to Cindy Dixon. Did not donate, but Corey and Pam, Corey from Clark Graphics, want me to say hello to Cindy Dixon in New Zealand, ladies and gentlemen. It's her birthday. It's Cindy's birthday. Lisa Sotil, it's your birthday. Happy birthday. Except I don't know the song you requested. If you could be a little more specific, I could do it. Chris Vander Hayden, happy birthday to you. Joel Slowinski is 42, Coach Slaw. Let's have a Coach Slaw, which is something that Kimmy Unger and Kevin would never eat because they don't like mayonnaise. <laughs> they do not eat slaw, Coach Slaw. Renee Ann is 60 years old. Wendy Murphy, Mur Murph's sister, who is not watching this show. No, she isn't. No. Wendy, if you're watching this show, Saturday in the park. I think it was the 4th of July. Jessica Rooplinger is 50 years old. Jessica and Gunnar Cunahan. Gunnar. Is there any manlier name than Gunnar? 
Gunnar Cunahan is 13 years old. Sarah and Stacy are watching this show at 4. It's 4 a.m. in Israel right now, ladies and gentlemen. And Sarah and Stacy are watching this show at 95. I, I know who they are. Switch it around now. Switch it around. Holly Davidson is watching this show in the United Kingdom right now. She's up there. She's watching this show. What time is it in the United Kingdom? It is six hours. Six hours ahead of It's late. Uh, Kirsten wants me to say hello to Jill and Joel Showalter on their 30th anniversary. Uh, Monica Hall, uh, always. Abby Laib. Chris Remaker, thank you for donating. Allison Graytons. Keith and Taffy Anderson. Thank you, Keith. I just love that name, Taffy. I don't even know Taffy, and I sort of, I don't know, I would like to just... Get rid of Keith somehow. And, uh, Pete Larritson, a gold, old friend of ours. Sandy Bacino from Sheboygan. I love Sheboygan. The Perez family from uh, Verona, Wisconsin. Thank you so much for donating. Troy, Meg, Julie, John, Andy from St. Louis. I had to see that evening sun go down. Julia Bosman, thank you. Susan and Tom from Chicago. Susan and Tom wanted me to sing bobblehead, bobblehead, bob, bob, bobblehead, 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 bob. Yeah, my song for the Bobblehead Museum. I don't even know how it goes. Richard Sullivan, thank you. There's another sheet there, Julian. Hold that one up. You are so good. What did you learn in Madison this semester? How to make burgers. Julian is a, a wor she, he works at the Memorial Union where I summer on most summers. Smokehouse turkeys and Rubens are his specialty, ladies and gentlemen. Dak Ragus. Dak Ragus is a name we say every week. Karen Becker Locke. Thank you, Karen. Savannah and Bryce. It's great to hear from you. Yeah. Savannah got her master's degree this week. Now she's a master. What the hell is she doing with Bryce? That's my question. Greg Scatrude. Derek Mosier. Yes, Derek Mosier. Lars Grabo. Uh, Scott Shoemaker wants me to say a happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday, Scott, from Dawn. Jared Finger, another comment. Jenny Conlon and Mike Conlon. I don't know if they're, re they're related, but they both donated. Lynn Fuller, uh, related to Bobby Fuller, who wrote the song. Breaking rocks in a hot sun. Steve and Penny Bregan. Oh, sorry, Steve. Steve and Peggy Brenner from Walk Always leave me a nice message. I love the messages. I'd love to know where you're from. <laughs> Ken Saffron. And I'd love you all to buy my CD. Did I mention that? <laughs> Kenneth Barnard. And Karen Reiner, the brother, uh, the sister of Mark Reiner. <laughs> the sister-in-law. One of those things. I don't know for sure. But thank you all for donating. Also, it's still time before Christmas. I am doing handwritten lyrics. And I am proud to say that I've done about 60 handwritten lyrics. And my... My wrist is still good, if you know what I mean. My wrist is ready for Christmas. Let's dip into the Addington bottle again. I, I name all my bottles of Jameson now. They're personalized that way. Raymond Reddington. <laughs> I promise wistful. I promise funny. I promise Christmas. Ah. Right now, I'd like to do one for Sarah. I think this is the best song I ever wrote. Ten years in the blink of an eye. Turn around and you told me goodbye and you got on a train. I didn't see you again till now. Ten years in the blink of an eye. Even now I'm wondering why I just stood in the rain. I got home but I don't know how. Oh, where does the time go? Where does the time go? Where does the time go? It goes flying by in the blink of an eye. Ten years in the beat of a heart. 
How long have we been apart? I know it's insane. But the feelings remain the same. Ten years in the beat of a heart. Your voice and the memories start to hurt all over again. And then you call my name. Where does the time go? Where does the time go? Where does the time go? It goes flying by in the blink of an eye. Do you remember how it felt when we were young? We had a moment in the sun. for you oh where does the time go where does the time go where does the time go it goes flying by in the blink of an eye it goes flying by in the blink of an eye the blink of an eye it goes flying by in the blink of an eye Aaron Patton Paul Jones of Massachusetts Shane from Massachusetts let's think about next year let's think about one 365 days till ten, from tonight can we think about that? Can we can we dare to think about 365 days from tonight? Hopefully, coronavirus will be behind us. I don't think we'll ever stop living with coronavirus. Because I listen to science. Am I right, Kevin, or am I right? Hopefully, I will be on the stage of Shank Hall, just starting my show right now, with a lot of colored lights. And Jesus, Jesus will be there, wearing the same scrunchie he's worn for the last 20 years. Paul, every dream I have is broken, every bubble has been burst, every ray of hope is faded, and things can't get much worse, but this time, next year, I go down to the ocean, jump in, and I'll float away. This time, next year, I'll go down to the ocean, jump in, and I'll float away. Hey, we got a microphone. We got a microphone that we can put up for. We got COVID protocols going on here. We got Murph. We got Kimmy. We got the Mistress of Alcohol. Can embarrass her again. They're gonna show you how it's done at home. Like this. this time, next year, 
Yeah. I go down. I go down. Through the ocean. Drop in. And I'll float away. Well, the rain came down in buckets for 39 days and nights. The next day the sun was shining. I guess we'll be all right. But this time, this time next year, next year I, go down, I go down to the ocean, jump in, and I'll float away. But this time, this time next, year, next year, I go down, I go down to the ocean, to the ocean jump in, and I'll float away. Guitar! to clear away the cobwebs that I completely cover me. Find a brand new way of living and a change of scenery. Oh, this, time, this time, next year, next year I, go down, I go down to the ocean, the ocean jump in, and I'll float away. This time, this time next year, Jump in, and I'll float away. Everybody, this time, this time next year, next year, I go down, I go down to the ocean. To the ocean jump, in, jump in, and I'll float away. Jump in, jump in and I'll float. I'm on a float away. I'll have a blue Christmas without you. So blue, just thinking about you. You'll be doing all right with your Christmas of what? But I'll have a blue, 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 blue Christmas. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much for watching my Christmas show. Everybody have a happy holiday. One more show this year, and that is next Saturday night, December 26th. We'll be playing hockey. Thank you to everybody who's been supporting me all year. Well, I'll be, I might cry next week. Until then, St. Paul in his letter to the Ephesians. Said it came to me upon a midnight clear. Said I finished writing all of my gospel. Now all I seem to want is sex and pain. Mark Antony looked down on Caesar's body. He said, friends, Romans, countrymen, lend me your ear. I come here to pray. <laughs> I came here for sex and bear. Sex and bear. Sex and bear. All the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear. Sex and bear. All the things we like around here. Oh. What the hell? It's Christmas. We've been doing COVID protocols for eight months to keep this little bubble going. Get up here and dance. Mistress, get up here. Barbara, get up here. George Washington, he never crossed the Delaware. 
there was no midnight rival for a beer. Ben Franklin never discovered electricity. They were too busy looking for sex and beer. Sex and beer, sex and beer. Are the two things we hold dear. Sex and beer, sex and beer. Are the things we like around here. Now Charles Dickens gave us a Christmas carol. Shakespeare gave us Hamlet and King Lear. Dostoevsky gave us crime and punishment. Who the hell is gonna give us? Sex and bear, sex and bear. Are the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear, sex and bear. Are the things we like around. Now from the city to the suburbs to the country, from the southern to the northern hemisphere, now holding a tremendous referendum, and everybody's choosing. They could take away our pride and our dignity. They could use up all our blood and sweat and tears. They could take away our names and give us numbers. Is it 59? 69! That's the day. But they will never take away our sex and Sex and bear. Sex and bear. The two things we hold dear, sex and bear, sex and bear, are the things we like around here. Okay, Julian, once more with feeling. Sex and bear, sex and bear, are the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear, oh, sex and bear. Are the things we like around here? All right, come on, come on. We've been in a bubble all this time. Kevin, get up here. It's quick, Kimmy, get up here. Barbara, Julia, you got a mask on? Welcome to our bubble. Get up here and dance. Mistress, move over there. Take the dog. One more time. Sex and bear. Sex and bear. Are the two things we hold dear? Sex and bear, sex and bear. Are the things we like around here? We like sex and and sex and bear and sex and bear and sex and bear. May your days be merry and bright. And may all your Christmases be wild. Thank you so much, everybody. See you next Saturday night. Come on.